Reglamates! It's me again, Gla, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. And if we're meeting for the first time, my name is Gla, short for Gliaza. I do bag reviews, bag comparisons, in unboxing anything under the sun if you're into it. I hope you consider in subscribing to my channel. And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. And also, please click the notification bell. It's like an alert that I have a new uploaded video. In different sizes I have um, yeah two robes and um, two different sizes um, the first one I think you have seen this before I uh, I did a review for the coach robe 25 in um, denim so and this one is the new um, coach robe that I'll be featuring here in my channel this is the coach robe um, 31 in nude pink so both of them have das bag and also they're both 1941 collection so this is the um cultural 25 in um denim and this one is the coach rogue in nude pink so, ako din, I'm super um, excited um, to see the difference between these two bags. Apart from the obvious, of course, the size, the color, um, kung may pagkakaiba pa sila even dun sa loob or features ng bag. So, yon. Siyempre, uh, very obvious naman, ba? Sabi ko nga, this one is in denim, this one is in nude pink. Okay? Um, this one is 25 and this one is 35. So, as you can see, Okay, you're able to see the difference. And later on, let's see kung ano yung mga mag-fit dito sa 31 versus this um, 25. Now, um, regarding the price, um, the retail price of this Coach Rogue 25 is $595. And this um, Nude Pink in 31, this one is in $795. So definitely, mas mahal to kasi mas malaki. And then, yung features niya, na, last time kasi guys, sorry lang, ma-share ma ko lang. Last time kasi sobrang haba ng video ko regarding the coach robe 25 denim. So this one, I'll try to be very quick since alam niyo naman na yung um, features nitong um, robe denim. And let's see if may difference sila dito sa coach robe 31. Okay? So, um, it has four feet. Meron siyang glab tan or genuine glab tan leather sa likod. This one has 4 feet din on uh, genuine glab tan leather na nakalagay. Pero, um, kung makikita nyo, this one is in brass hardware. Yan, this one is in brass hardware. But, um, for the Row 31, it's actually in Peter hardware. So, it's not in brass hardware. Yan. They have also... The 1941 um, tag, hand tag, wait, there, their hand tag. So, in brass color, and then this one is in bitter color. So, that's the difference. Um, regarding the size, so let's measure it very quickly. Itong um, coach row 31. Twelve inches is the length, the height is ten inches, and then the depth is uh five inches. So you know uh what do you call this measurement nitong coach row 31. And inside of this bag, um fabric lining and suede lining din siya in um this one is in burgundy or in wine color yan or ox blood color two open compartments same as the road 25 two open compartments and then meron siyang middle compartment na meron siyang zipper and also inside 
Okay, tanggalin lang din natin yung mga stuffing. Inside, ito meron siyang two um, straps that you can actually link together para maging crossbody. Yan. And also as a shoulder band then. And then sa middle compartment, ito yung fabric lining niya. Um, ito talaga yung parang sa 1941 collection na fabric or cloth. But dito sa Pilipinas, para siyang cut siya kung makikita nyo. Yan. And yun, oh! Ang difference niya guys, meron siyang French bucket or parang meron siya, ayan oh, meron siyang French pocket. So, andito yung gift receipt. Yan. The, the, the Rogue 25 kasi, wala siyang French pocket. Ang meron siya is this one. Yan. But the Rogue, the Rogue 31, meron siyang French bucket. Kaya rin siguro siya mas mahal. Ayan. And then, meron din siya ditong, yan, meron siya ditong pocket, zipper pocket, yan. And then, nandun yung, uh, what do you call this? Andito tong, oh my god, I forgot. Uh, creed, ayun. Uh, ayan yung creed ng bag, so yan. So yun, pretty much it. Um, same sila parehas ng um, features inside except for the French bucket or French pocket rather. And yan, yung mga hardware and um, D-ring para dun sa ila, para dun sa strap para maging shoulder bag or crossbody bag. And then let's try to put things inside kung ano yung magkakasya. So, for the notebook, Dito sa open pocket, hindi siya magkakasya ng... Hindi siya magkakasya for the 25. Kasya siya sa middle compartment. Ayan. This is the regular um, notebook. Sa middle compartment lang ng 25. But here in the 31, kasya siya sa open compartment. Parehas. Same size lang naman. And of course, sa middle compartment, kasya din siya. Um, this one is the iPad Air. So definitely, hindi ito magkakasya sa um, Rogue 25. This one here is open compartment. Kasha. Yan, sa two open compartments. Kasha. Even also, sa middle. Kasha. Kasha siya, guys. Ayan. As in, maraming ano to, mas roomy to, mas spacious, mas marami kayong malalagay for the 31. Um, let's see kung kaya to, a 14-inch laptop can fit inside. Definitely, dun sa open compartments, hindi siya magkakasya. But, dito sa middle, it will not fit also. Yeah, it will not fit. For the, this is a 14-inch laptop. Probably, siguro mga 10-inch a laptop or uh, notebook kasha. Yun. But for the 14 inches, no, hindi siya magkakasha. So, yun guys, um, sa akin siguro, para sa akin ha, kung mas, this one is 31, and this one is 25. Siguro kung medyo mas nala, nalalakihan kasi ako, this one is actually medium to large bag. Um, and medyo Ma medyo mabigat siya, kinda heavy versus dito. Well, syempre naman, mas malaki naman to. So, it's kinda mas mabigat talaga to as compared to the 25. Pero this one, medyo may bigat din talaga itong robe because of this um, top handle. Um, ako, kung mamimili ako between the 25 and the 31, ang pipiliin ko pa rin is this 25. I'm not, I don't know, kasi siguro, uh, masyado akong na-addict or masyado akong nagagandahan na ngayon sa mga maliliit na bags. Unlike before that, um, I love um, tote bags, I love um, medium to large bags. But right now, medyo, I, I don't know, I'm loving um, small, mini uh, bags, um, crossbody bags. So, nag-iiba rin talaga. Kaya ako, mas choice ko to. I think mas perfect yung size nito. And if ever na magkaroon ng 28, for me, 
that would be the perfect size for robe. For me, ha, kasi in between siya ng 25 and 31 eh. This one, para sa akin, too big. Although, okay siya kapag sa office because you can put all of your um, things, your notebooks, your KK kits, your um, tablets, ganon, yung mga maliliit lang na kasha dito, your umbrella, kasha ang kasha siya. But this one, siguro, um, pwede rin naman pang office, um, konti lang, pero para sa akin siguro pwede rin to na um, coming from the office and then diretso for a dinner date, ganyan. Kasi ang ganda niya, lakas ng maka-alta kapag top handle. But, um, let's see, I'm gonna show you kung paano naman, um, kung ano yung itsura kapag nakasuot yung Coach Rogue 31. If you wanted to see naman yung Coach Rogue 25, um, ililink ko na lang yung video ng Rogue 25 kasi nagawa ko na rin, nagawan ko na rin naman ng review yun para ma-check ma nila. Okay, so right now, I'm gonna show you on how it looks like kapag um, suot na natin itong Rogue 25 and Rogue 31. Um, I think three ways to wear, but for me kasi, ang pinaka-favorite to would be using it. Yung parang top handle lang siya, and um, yung shoulder bag hindi masyado, as well as with the crossbody, but I'm gonna show you kung anong itsura. So first is as a top handle, so pwede yung ilagay sa creep ng arm nyo, ganyan siya. Ayan. Ganyan siya parehas. So kung makikita nyo. I don't know, para sa akin, I like it better pa din um, ng ganito siya. I mean, mas gusto ko talaga yung size ng 25. So, kahit na ganyan. But if you're um, into a medium to large bags, okay sa inyo yung 31. But para sa akin, um, I'll go with the 25. So, ganyan. Ganyan yung itsura niya kapag ang um, gamit niya siya or nakalagay sa crick ng arm niyo. Pwede niyo rin naman siyang gamitin lang or kawakan mo nung ganyan, the top handle, ganyan, habang naglalagay. I'm not sure if you're able to see it, pero ganun, alam niyo naman yung ibig kong sabihin. So, ganyan. Next, napapakita ko would be as a shoulder bag. So, kunin ko lang itong mga straps. So, yan. Ikakabit lang natin siya dyan sa mga D-ring both sides. Actually, guys, itong road denim ko, hindi ko pa siya nagagamit. I think, nagamit ko lang siya dito sa review, but, yung talagang nagamit outside, sa mga pag-alis-alis, hindi. Okay, um, one more D-ring. Okay, so yan, as a shoulder bag naman, so ganito siya. Yan, ito yung 31, so ganyan siya. And this one is the um, 25, so ganyan siya. So, yan. As a shoulder bag, <laughs> ewan ko medyo biased or biased talaga ako kasi mas gusto ko yung 25. Kaya, sa shoulder bag, para sa akin yung 25 pa rin. Pero, again, um, depende pa rin sa preference nyo. Pero, ganyan siya kapag nakasuot. So, ganyan. Okay pa rin naman yung drop ng bag. Hindi naman masakit sa kilikili. As in, sobrang uh, mababa naman siya yung drop ng bag. So, okay. You can move freely. Okay. Yeah, at yung chanela ko. <laughs> so, ganyan. And then, yung isa naman, as a crossbody bag, um, although ako, para sa akin, <laughs> feeling ko kasi hindi talaga siya pang crossbody bag. So, tatagdan ko lang ito. Pwede nyo kasi i-link yung yung strap straps para ma, pwede siyang maging crossbody so ito ganyan lang or pwede ganyan pwede na naman isa lang ganyan oh my god sorry na please don't have to sorry mo lang ganyan isa so ganyan and then teka ibaba ko lang muna itong 31 
And ganyan lang siya guys. As a crossbody bag. So, ganyan. Okay din naman, but for me kasi, may weight may weight na tong bag, and lalo na kapag nilagyan mo pa siya ng gamit. And yung strap niya, medyo maliit lang, and ito lang siya, sa D-ring lang siya. So, uh, para sa akin, hindi siya ganun, ka-perfect as a shoulder bag. Um, pero kung konti lang naman yung ilalagay niyo, okay lang din. So, ganyan. As a crossbody bag, try natin yung um, Rogue 31 as a crossbody bag. Then, yan. Tapos, ipag-meet lang natin ito. Pwede na rin naman yung isa. So, ganyan siya. As a crossbody bag. So, lalo na sa 31, hindi siya ganun ka-appealing kapag crossbody bag. Ano ako ganyan lang. Para sa akin kasi sobrang malaki ng bag, tapos yung buong weight na doon, mas manipis lang yung strap. Well, para sa akin lang naman yun, that's my opinion. So, pero ganyan siya kapag crossbody bag. So there, yun yung three ways on how to wear the coach group. That's it guys, that's the end of the video. And if you like this video again, please give me a thumbs up. And if you're not yet subscribed to my channel, I hope you consider in subscribing to my channel and hit the notification bell so that you will be notified on my next video. And I'll talk to you again next time, lovemates. Bye!